In the urgent push to beat back a deadly pathogen, researchers at NYU have now started clinical trials on a never-before-tried genetic vaccine candidate developed by Pfizer along with a German partner. Rather than trying to manipulate the live virus itself, this vaccine attempts to reprogram the virus's genetic code. Melissa Huntkinen, whose husband is a doctor at NYU, is among the first 12 healthy Americans to receive the injection. So many people are being affected by this pandemic and I figured it was would be a great thing to do to help during an unprecedented time. Here's what makes this unique. The vaccine carries the genetic code known as messenger RNA that instructs the cells to make the proteins associated with the coronavirus but without making someone sick. The hope is that the immune system then kicks in to create the antibodies to fight off COVID-19. And Pfizer has four genetic vaccine candidates. Dr. Mark Mulligan is running the NYU trial. It really is a natural thing because this messenger RNA is something the body produces on its own normally. So it's it's kind of a new thing, but it's it's really not anything that's too different than what the body does for itself. Because it's natural, it's also believed to be safe. But experts point out it's still experimental and vaccines normally take years to develop. We don't yet have a licensed vaccine uh, for RNA or DNA vaccines because in the past they've worked very well in laboratory animals, but those immune responses have not translated into human good human immune responses. Worldwide, there are now roughly 100 vaccine candidates under review. Researchers at Pfizer believe this genetic code vaccine could be available as soon as September. It is probably the fastest way of having a vaccine available to stem this pandemic. Are you more optimistic about this type of vaccine compared to a typical vaccine that we've seen in the past? I am optimistic, but the data will speak for themselves, Tom. Uh, this is the nice thing about science. You don't have to have faith or belief. The, the answer will come from uh, the investigations that we do. Melissa Honkinen, a yoga instructor, went home hours after receiving the first shot on Monday. How are you feeling? I feel fine. My arm's just a little sore. I don't have any headaches. I, I feel like myself. All right, Tom joins me now. Tom, Pfizer's not the only company working on a vaccine like this, right? No, that's right. Uh, Moderna, Inovio, and CanSino are also involved in this kind of research. Importantly, never before has a genetically altered vaccine made its way to market. This is cutting-edge stuff, but Pfizer believes it could have a vaccine within four months. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here. And click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.